Hey everyone, this is Abhinin from CG Artist Academy and uh, I'm back with a new tutorial. For the very first time, I'm gonna create a tutorial about Houdini, how to tear a cloth. Okay, recent, recently I did a R&D on tear of clothing, which is this. I'm going to tell you how to create this kind of stuff so let's get into Houdini okay. press tab to get the tab, to get the menu and type geometry okay rename it tier of setup get into it create a sphere okay and it should be a polygon sphere next add a subdivide so, yep correct and uh, here in the frequency let's put three okay now copy the setup okay so this is the inside geometry and this is the part which we're gonna tear off okay so next thing I'm gonna create a remesh to triangulate my mesh. Okay. And here the value should be around 0.5. The more dense, the more subdivision you have, the better quality of cloth you can get, the simulation you get. Okay. Next thing I'm gonna add is edge fracture. Edge fracture shop, connect this and click on this show geometry so I can see the fracture fracture parts and enable this primitive piece and click on this tab so I can see how many pieces I'm getting. So right by default let's get the 10 pieces. I'm gonna have around 100 Yeah, maybe 150. Okay. So, one more thing I need to do is I need to scale it a bit around point zero one. Okay. Next thing I want to do is just deselect this visualization and vellum cloth next vellum well and vellum solver connect these and connect this into this now select the vellum okay next thing I want to do is add a collision geometry which is this and put it into the collision tab okay so far it's almost the setup is done okay go to the forces and it should be around two and in the minus in the x i, I need a value of minus four okay let's simulate Yeah. 
it's getting the cloth feel but I haven't added the tier of things so go to your belt here you can find a breaking and select this and value should be around 0 0.05 and let's simulate again it's not getting tear off I need to see why maybe the value is little low 0.1 Now you can see it started tear off tearing off. Yeah. So one more thing I need to do is increase the fracture value here be around 250. So I get the small pieces. Like, I, like in my the video you can see some some of the geometry is like sticking to the object let's do that go to a vellum cloth and here you can find a tab called pin to animation click here and select which part you want select the points which you want to like stick to the geometry like this shift here 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 and press enter and these points are added let's again go to this and simulate as you can see the points I have selected are sticking to the geometry and other than that everything is like tearing off so that's pretty much it and one more thing we need to do in the end is vellum post process vellum post process yeah let's add this so it give you more detailed instead of uh, you're gonna if you wanna more detailed uh, simulation you're gonna add sub subdivisions so in this process it does by by default okay so that's it let's simulate check it yeah now it's up to you it's completely procedural you can add whatever model you want to add to the simulation and uh, experiment by yourself and if you want to like export this data you can easily do that too all you need is tap drop alembic output that's it connect this to this in this render frame range what are the frame range you have and export as alembic format so all this animation will export it to the alembic file and you can import in any 3d application so that's it i guess that's the very basic setup which i have used in my simulation which is this again you can see that i did the same thing here's my geometry I did some transformation, remash, head fracture, cloth, weld, solver, post process, and that's how I exported the alembic for alembic data. So that's pretty much it, and that's how you can easily easily create this kind of effect in Houdini. So I hope you like this tutorial and uh, find the find the tricks valuable to apply on your projects and i hope you will like and subscribe my channel thanks for watching